just being able to use my art talent for God has been such a great thing. A lot of times I'm forced to choose either doing a ministry thing or doing something with my art or doing something in ministry or doing, you know, teaching and working with art. And this has been an opportunity to do both. And um, also, like Jane said, I'm not as experienced with set design and, and the logistics of hanging plexiglass from windows and, and things like that. So for me, it's, it's a great opportunity to work with Jane and to um, kind of learn from her and to, to, to do this project. So I'm really excited. I just graduated from art school and I spent five years sort of learning the, the craft of art and everything and I feel like I've been given a great gift and never really given back on it at all. So when you guys called me and asked me about this, I was really excited to actually give back for once and this is really, you know, that's why I started out in this. We're, we're doing these, these painted flats here, we're going to go on the walls and then we're hanging plexiglass panels over them with symbols that were designed by um, by high school students. Well, one big good blessing is that every time we get frustrated, the two of us just stop and pray together. And that's like a huge thing to be able to do that. Like, just to have the grace of, you know, God immediately mm -hmm. in the project. For him to be the focus, like, every time I get stuck on trying to figure out the designs and everything, all I have to do is that, you know, think about all these things, you know, like we have our prayer group on Monday nights and we go and we read the Bible and we talk to each other about this stuff. So it's, a, it's everything having to do with, you know, art blocks. And <laughs> that, that's a good part. But I mean, it's all encompassing. Um, this project too has been such a spiritual project. Um, it's like sometimes you get caught up and you think that God is so big and yeah, he cares about you, and yeah, he's going to help you, like, what do I do with my life kind of decisions. But when we were working on this, it was like, we realized, like, we're picking out the furniture. Like, well, this isn't the first furniture we picked out, and we had other things. Not the second, it, or not the, the second third. or the third, but it worked out. And, and it's like, you forget, like, God is perfect, and I'm made in God's image. And if my gift is a gift of art, like, that's, God did that. And God has a really good aesthetic sense. We're learning that. <laughs> like you, can, you don't just say, "God, help me figure out what I'm going to do with my life." It's like, "God, figure, help me figure out like Which how to do this sure. logo. Yeah. What font do I use?" Like to ask God for those little things is is incredible, and um, that kind of mirrors my life in a way that it's it's teaching me. You know, God is the center of the whole thing. It's all about God, and it it has to be.